Hi, I'm John Shaw with Century 21 Limac Realty. I'm here at 604 Leatherwood Drive at this beautiful three bedroom, two and a half bath home with a lovely open floor plan. It's in the city, but oh my, it seems like it's in the country. Look at this peaceful driveway, leads back to a large two car garage and a very secluded backyard. I think you're gonna love this home. It's got a beautiful front yard. Um, I like this yard. The house is raised a little bit and the yard slopes down toward the street. And again, it's landscaped, a lot of beautiful interest areas around and uh, there's a lot that could be done to it still. And here's the front door, let's go. 604 Leatherwood Drive. Let's go ahead and take a look. Isn't this a lovely entryway? I love this and uh, it's a long hall that and it goes through the house all the way to the backyard. And on this side is the living room with the great room and the kitchen and uh, the two bedroom suites. And on this side is what I'm calling the family room and one more bedroom. And then there's a guest bath over here. This is what I'm calling the living room. It's a lovely room. It's got uh, large windows looking out on the front yard and it's got a gas fireplace and two Windows looking out on the side yard and uh, a lovely tray ceiling. And then right off of this room is uh, a bedroom or I think, I think the uh, previous owners used this as a office and I think that's a good use for it too. But I was also thinking with that being a bedroom, then this could be um, sort of a, a sitting room area for someone if, if there was a uh, another person living in the home and wanted a little bit of privacy, well, that'd be available to them here. Well, this is the third bedroom. It's got a nice walk-in closet over here, plenty of room in that closet. And it has these built-in shelves, which uh, I think make it perfect for an office or a den, uh, but it's certainly uh, perfect also for a bedroom. And it would be no problem. It's got a couple of nice Windows looking out on the side yard. Let's go through uh, the rest of the house. Everything else is on the other side over here, so this is private. On the other side of the hall is uh, what I'm calling the living room. Uh, it could also be a great room, and uh, it's, uh, it's right connected and very open to the kitchen and the dining area. This room is very large and it has a large bay window looking out on the front yard. And then it is totally open to the dining area right here and then to the kitchen area. Now, I love this island kitchen. It just makes it uh, so convenient. There's the living area. Here's the dining area. It could be a breakfast nook over here. Plenty of counter space, cabinets, uh, the microwave, built-in oven, refrigerator, cooktop, dishwasher, and even a little desk over here. And then this door opens right out to the backyard. Uh, what well, everything's here, you know, that you would want if you had uh, guests or you were entertaining or you had family here, uh, this would be perfect for that. Let's go and look at the rest of the house. Over here, there's two bedroom suites. Both of these are in suite. That means they have a, a private bathroom, a walk-in closet, and a bedroom all together. Right here is the uh, laundry room, very convenient between the two bedrooms, and has a deep sink, and then a very large linen closet here, and this is the smaller of the two in-suite bedrooms. And although this is the smaller of the two in-suite bedrooms, it is a very large bedroom, and it has a walk-in closet over here and a full bathroom over there. This is a very large walk-in closet with shelves built in already and large windows overlooking the front yard. And then over here we have a full private bathroom with a single vanity and a tub shower combination. Very convenient. Now let's go down to the other end of the hall and look at the larger of the two uh, end suite bedrooms. Well, this is the larger of the two end suite bedrooms and it is giant. There's a huge walk-in closet in here, plenty of room, and 
private bathroom, double vanity, walk-in shower, and separate jetted tub. And then all this room in here, this uh, is a very large uh, primary bedroom suite, and it has a, a large picture window looking out over the backyard and letting in plenty of light. And then there is a door right on out to the uh, covered patio and the backyard. Well, the garage is right off the kitchen and very convenient. Let's go in and take a look at it. This is an oversized garage, 23 by 23. will fit a really large truck in here if you wanted. Uh, and it has a lot of interesting features. It has a deep sink, a uh, newer water heater, and a uh, uh, central vac. Well, let's go outside and take a look at that backyard. I think you'll find it uh, with the covered patio is really sweet. This is, uh, this is a large covered patio. It's got a door here that comes out from the primary bedroom suite. And I love this setup with the covered patio and then the large yard with the different interest areas. And it's uh, getting on to be fall here right now. So some of the leaves are coming down, but uh, this is all lush in the, uh, in the spring and summer. But whether it's fall or uh, winter or spring or summer, it wouldn't make any difference. This is still pretty sweet. Well, I'm John Schaub, and I hope you've enjoyed this uh, tour of this beautiful home, 604 Leatherwood. If you'd like to know more about it, you can contact me at enjoytheozarks.com or call me 870-656-7888. John Schaub. Century 21 Lee Mac Realty, 1024 Highway 62B East in Mountain Home, Arkansas. Thanks for watching.